Hello, here we are in Hamburg, Germany, and we're filming today at Emma School, where we've been filming for the last week. I guess the best part about filming here is you can see the contrast between Singapore and Germany, the two schools that we filmed at. There's a couple of differences, but this building is built in the 1900s, so it's over 100 years old, so it's beautiful to see the German landscape and the architecture. And this being one of those places, it's inside phenomenal, like there's old tiles, old doors. It's just brilliant to be able to see an older world with more character and history. Hi, so where exactly is this workroom? I'm lost. I'll put you onto Emma for directions. Alright, so you go all the way to the top floor. And then turn right. Okay, and I'm only going to say this once, but I told you so. I know, I know. The school should really think about installing an elevator. The uniforms is a big difference. In Singapore we had the very prim and proper uniforms. We had the long blue dress, the lovely white shirt and the badges and our hair tied back. Just like normal school back home for me. But um, in Germany here, everyone wears casual clothes. What is it, Emma? You haven't cut your whole arm off this time? No, I just wanted to hand in my art project. A few days late. Your art project? But I've already got it. No, you haven't. This is it. We've got the tutoring van, so that's all we've got for schooling, but we sit in there, do our work, and then quickly on to set, quickly back. Hi, I'm here in the tutoring van, which is like our little mini classroom. And this is where we come in between the fun of filming to do our normal schoolwork. I'm doing year 12 this year, which is a lot of work, but I'm having to do as much as I can so that I can get good marks and hopefully get into a good uni next year. So even though we're having a lot of fun shooting the TV show, we still have to come back here and do all our work. Both Charlotte and myself are students um, in Melbourne. So as students, um, obviously we haven't been able to go to a proper school because we would have to travel thousands and thousands of kilometres and it would cost thousands and thousands of dollars and it would be incredibly pointless. I don't think you have to explain why we can't go to school. We're <laughs> in anyway. Germany. Yes. So, um, um, uh, basically what I've been doing, I'm doing my final year of school this year, so I've been studying via distance education, which is like by correspondence, so my schoolwork gets sent to me, um, sort of, I have a big book that set teaches me what I need to know and then has certain work that I need to do and send back to my teachers to then send back to me. So basically it's exactly what I would learn in a classroom except that I do it all myself. Um, For me, um, I'm in year 10 so it's a little less hardcore than year 12 but um, it's, just a little. It's, um, it's still hard because we've still got to one, do your lines, do your scenes and concentrate on doing your actual job but also you've got to still maintain yeah. um, your schooling because well, we've got, we've got to go back to school eventually. Yeah. So. And and if you get behind, then when you get back, it's just like just, normal students, yeah. really. For me, I've got um, Alison, who is our tutor on set, um, and she's been with us since Sydney, um, so she's been travelling with us. Great job for her, but she's been brilliant as far as um, she contacts the schools and they get the work. And so, um, opposite to Charlotte, who's doing it all herself and doing distance education, um, I'm doing it all through my school. Forming a star. Wow, Alison. Yeah.